What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over some stuff. Um, we're going over the market, man, all that good stuff. So, uh, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up. Comment down below. It would be greatly, greatly appreciated, man. Straight up, greatly, greatly appreciated. Um, we're going over the market. Hold up, why is my face cam so small? We gotta make that bigger. Oh, wrong thing. Um, but yeah, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up. Comment down below. It would be greatly, greatly appreciated, man. Um, we're on the road to, uh, what, 14,000 subs? We're gonna go over the market. The market is up a lot. Uh, if you guys don't know, I'm a huge Tyrese Halliburton guy. Huge. I love him. He's just beautiful. He's the GOAT. Um, I think that this man right here was, honestly, I, I sniped out a couple of him at around 9K. He's a very good investment, in my opinion. If you get him for the right price, he's a little pricey right now. He's at like 10K. You have to get him for pretty cheap. But yo, Tyrese Halliburton is a G. He's one of my favorite players. Not only that, man, if you guys need MC, hit me up. I am buying and selling MC. But yo, we're going to go over the market. We're going to go over the auction, man. Let's see what the Galaxy Obels are doing right now. Looks like the market's up. Dark Matter, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar was around 350 yesterday. He's up to 500,000 MT. Um, Rondo's down in value. A lot of cards are down in value. We're just going to go over it and whatnot. Um, oh, wait a second. Wait a second. All right, okay. So my, I thought, I really thought for a second my game volume was off the charts like the other day. If you guys remember that. But yeah, I don't think it is. So... We're going over the market, man. Let's see. So Rondo is at 50 something K. Why? This Rondo card is low key insane. Um, I think Rondo might be a prime investment if you get him for the right price. Um, me personally, I've been eyeing Rondo down all week. He was at eight or not all week, all last couple days. And Rondo, the man Rondo. Rondo was pretty cheap, man. Rondo was cheap for a very long time. I think you guys definitely should monitor Rondo. I think a very, very good point guard in my opinion. He is a little short. But he can shoot, he can dunk, he also has amazing defense. Why is nobody speaking about Rondo? I'm guessing his jump shot is definitely off the charts of whack. Um, so I am definitely going to be keeping my eyes on Rondo. 52k is not a bad price. I think Rondo should go up in value as long as there is no super packs on Tuesday. There'll probably be super packs the following week. But this Rondo, man, for 52,000 MT, this card's pretty goaded. And there's a lot popping up consistently, so... I don't know. This Rondo card's looking good. Definitely a prime investment if you get him for maybe a little under 50k. I think a little bit under 50k, he's a prime investment. And not only that, you could use him. So uh, definitely keep your eyes out for my man, Rondo. Um, definitely a key investment. Not only that, Galaxy Global Cheapest Filter is ruined even more by Rondo. So I don't think he can go that much cheaper. It's a 98 overall that's absolutely insanely cracked. That's just how I feel. So keep your eyes out. I think I, I'm going to buy him for 52k, honestly. That's what I'm going to do. I'm definitely buying that Rondo for 52k, and then he's over 53k. So that's how I'm going to buy him at. I have to do his XP. I got to do a lot of XP, man. I'm super behind. We're probably going to do that tomorrow on Easter and get like 15k XP done. Um, you got to try to get at least like 25k XP a week, in my opinion. That's the goal. And of course, right when I buy that one, there's one for cheaper, right? Every time. Um, but looking over the market, man. Today's a good day to sell. Tomorrow's an even better day to sell. Look at this. Kareem with a shoe and 25 contracts. Let's compare him to mine. Oh, he has some extra Halls badges. All right. I have a Hall of Fame Clamps badge. So if there is a player without a Hall of Fame Clamps, man, let me know. I'll add it onto him and make some MT. Um, this is pretty cool. Pretty cool stuff right here. Galaxy Opals are um very, very down, but the market is up. That's the that's the weird thing. Let's see if the market's up with a couple more players that I've been eyeing down. Let's check if it's worth selling today and or tomorrow. I usually sell Monday or Wednesday. Those are my data sells, and look at this, man. Lamar Odom is definitely rising up a little bit. He was dirt, dirt cheap. He's still cheap. I have a couple left, man. I'm only going to make like 3K now because he did drop a lot, and I still have two left. So market's definitely rising up. It looks like the pink diamonds every single week are going to drop 10K plus if they're over a certain amount. Um, let's check out Malik Sealy. Last time I checked, he was dropping like crazy. Um, I got my Malik Sealy's for not too much expense. Not too expensive, but here we go. Malik Sealy. 14,000 MT. So Malik Sealy ended up going right back up. He was around 10K yesterday. He's back at 14K. So I'm going to sell him. Oh, wait. Did I sell him all or did he not sell? Let's see. Oh, yeah. Look at this. So Malik Sealy. I was trying to sell my Malik Sealy's on Panic. 
for what? Oh, really cheap, man. So Malik Sealy, man, he's going to the collection. Tyrese Halliburton, one of my favorites. Um, some of my investments, man, we still got some more investments to sell. Not too many, though. Um, also, Clem Haskins, Jason Richardson, if you invested in them, they're all big time. Amethysts are all big time. And why is that? Because these packs do not guarantee Amethyst, bro. These packs are not guaranteed Amethyst cards, so you're not going to see cheap Amethyst. You know what I'm saying? So the Amethyst filter should be kicking up crazy today. Um, you just got to know who to buy. Jay Rich, Clem Haskins. Let's check what their prices are out after a week of them not being in packs. Actually, no. It's been a day since they're out of packs. Let's check out Clem Haskins. And look at this. Clem Haskins. Is he over 1800 Clem Haskins is over 1900 man. This guy's at 2K. So you could get this car for 1100 He's already at 2000 MT. If you do the math, that's a lot of MT made. That's over 800 MT, th MT made every single Clem Haskins. You invested 100K, you're getting 880K. So investments, man, absolutely absurd. Same with Jay Rich. Let's check out Jay Rich. Um, definitely a card that is just wow, just wowza. Jay Rich is even more. I have a couple Jay Rich. I want to invest more, but I had investments somewhere else. Look at that. Jay Rich was at 1100, 1150, 1050, 1000. Some are 950. And look at this. He's at 2150. After 2150, he's at 2250, guys. These investments were absolutely insane. Now, is it worth selling them today? Honestly, take the W now if you did invest. Um, I'm gonna take the W now. Every single amethyst is up in value. It's time to sell. Let's go over another card. Let's go over one more. Mr. Mark Eaton. Let's see if he went up. He was a 9k pink diamond center. He's tall as hell, great on defense, and looks like he went up too. How much up though? He can't be over 10. Wow, Mark Eaton's over 10-7. Oh my god, look at that. So if you invested in Mark Eaton as well, the man's at like 13, he was at 8. All right, that's pretty cool. So 12-7. All right, he's like 12, 12-6, 12, 12. Yeah, wow, okay. Mark Eden's another one that's up a lot. 8K to 12 what? 8K to 12-3. So that's pretty fire. That's another investment. 3K profit there. If you invested 10 at 80K, um, then you would do 10. You would make 30K profit off 80K. That's pretty solid to me. Easy 30K. He's going to sell quick. Um, literally a week of waiting is easy MT. This is exactly how I make MT every single week. So now this week, is there investments right now? No. Like I said, the market is going to rise because there wasn't insane packs. There wasn't guaranteed packs. These packs were okay. Um, I'm not a fan of DMAR. I'm not a friend. I'm not really, I don't even check Ingram, so I can't say anything. But these packs aren't OP. They're not guaranteed. So you're not going to see a lot of investments. You know what I'm saying? So honestly, that's all we got for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys need MT, any of that. Um, but yeah, make sure to go follow us like a channel, follow the TikTok. And that is all we got for the video, man. Have a good one. Peace.